Okay, let's look at how you would subtract one mixed number from another mixed number. Now, before we can go ahead and subtract the fractions, we have to make them top heavy. So the three whole ones here, we have to incorporate into this fraction. So three whole ones is the same as 15 fifths, plus the two fifths we've got means that this three and two fifths becomes 17 fifths. Now, one whole one is the same as three thirds, so one times three is three, add the one gives you four thirds. Now, before we can do the subtraction, we need to look for a lowest common multiple between five and three. So, if we list the multiples of five here, it's five, 10, 15. Multiples of three are three, six, nine, 12, and 15. So now we've got our lowest common multiple. We can rewrite these two fractions as fractions out of 15, which is also gonna give us an answer out of 15. So to change a five into a 15, we multiply by three. So we need to multiply the top of that by three. To change a three into a 15, we need to multiply it by five. So we need to multiply the top by five. Three lots of 17 is 51. Four lots of five is 20. And now you just subtract the top two numbers. So 51 take away 20 leaves 31. Now you can change that into a mixed number. So how many 15s fit into 31? Well, it's two, two 15s are 30, so there is one 15th left over, and that's your answer, two and one 15th.